William here, back with another great video. So we're back here. So we're getting ready for Black Fly, race number two. So my stuff's all loaded. I gotta go pick up Ben or Little Aubrey, whatever you wanna call him, or David McKenna. If you want, to go pick him up. So just run over my classes for today. Look in the shades so you guys can see you guys too. So that pink truck is my new SC6.1 with my layback transmission in it with a gear diff. So I just got that in this past week. I put lots of work in, new bearings, new times. We'll see what happens, all right? Next up is my four-wheel drive Techno SCT 410.3. That is the winning and TQing carpet setup. So we'll see how it competes this week. Down here with my brand new setup on it, after how bad I did last race day with it, is my EB410, my Techno, so my four-wheel drive 10 scale buggy. Right here we got my B6.1 carpeted car. So now I actually got carpet tires up front. I was running pinpoints up front and that did not work for the track. So now we're running swaggers. So that's doing a lot better. All right. Over there, that orange with yellow, right there with the white rims. That is my two-wheel drive stadium truck, also known as my ET210. So that is my techno two-wheel drive conversion with a B64 slipper in it. Thank you to Nick for ProStar. That worked amazingly. And that's Nick's setup. And this is one of my, my another stuff I tried, but if it doesn't work in testing day today, because we're heading up, I'm heading up in a few minutes. So if it doesn't work for testing tonight when I go there, I am dropping a whole new setup on for race day. And then the other one you see back there is a pink white. A lot of people don't know I own this yet. This is my X-Ray T4 2019 edition. So I'm bringing that for testing because you don't race that because of course it's all off-road stuff. But the carpet for about half an hour, um, they leave the carpet flat. for just like testing cars, straight up tune. Some of us have on-road stuff, so we put our on-road stuff on. So I'm getting that ready because not next weekend, but the weekend after that. So from two weekends from the race I'm at now, we will be officially, we'll be at Red Clay. So Red Clay is running a race. Uh, leave in the comments if you guys want me to record Red Clay or not. Uh, usually I don't because of music and copywriting issues, but hey, if you guys want me to, I can always record. I'll work around the music. So this is my T417, I have a, or 19, sorry. I have a whole setup on it, never raced it. I just got it over the summer. It's running a 17.5 motor with a hobby wing. I think it's just stock ESC for now. I'm getting a better ESC for it though. So yeah, so that's what we got. Um, that's my parts bin, my other totes down there, my tires, my charger, my lipos, and then everything else. I have a soldering, I have a lamp, with that green thing you guys see. So yeah, that's what we're doing. So it's looking pretty good for us today. So we're going to pack up. I'm gonna let you guys go there. I'll pick you probably up when I get Ben stuff or on the road. Sorry guys. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So I'm gonna pick up Ben in about an hour or so and then we're heading out. So we'll talk to you guys when we're at the shop or later. Hey guys, we're back. So we are at the bridge leaving it. So we got Ben and my mom's driving and we got all our stuff back here as you guys can see. So yeah. So we're picking you up. We will pick you guys up probably at the track, I think, next, maybe next stop. So yeah, we're heading right to the track now. So yeah, we'll pick you up in about four hours. Hey guys, we're back with another video. So I guess I said that, we're just continuing the video on. So we're at the races, right? This is how you know we're such a great race. So a racer needed his tires glued, he didn't have glue. I got my trusty old Proline glue from the Proline glue tips. Usually don't bring it to race day, but I'm like, do you know I want to bring it this time. Well, so, so then I got this, so we're all set. So the key thing you want to make sure is that you have a good rubber band, good rim, good rubber. All right, so you can reuse your rim. Just make sure it's nice and clean. What? Good rim, good rubber. <laughs> <laughs> just, just so tip is you want, you want the nice long tip. I don't like it too short because I find it gets too stiff and you get too much glue right at the end. So that's Trevor out there that's doing all the trash talking right now. So, Hey, Trevor. Hey, buddy. There's only one kind of talking and that's trash talking. <laughs> there we go. So we're doing pretty good. Everything's been tested. I've been doing pretty good. Um, the only thing I didn't test was my touring car. So my T419. The jumps got put up quicker. So I am going to go test that here in a little bit. Um, I just got to glue these tires. Do glue inside of these tires. I'll test that. And then I'll come back, flip it, glue that side. So we'll be all set. So these are going on a Techno short course. So it would be a 410.3. So that's what's going on. So pretty good, yeah. I say. Um, yeah. So we'll pick you guys up later on tomorrow. I'll do a pick walk probably tomorrow. It's uh, 
Oops, guys, I'm gonna lose you a second. It is 10.15 at night. So the race is at 7.30. Are we coming for 7.30 in the morning? We're not going home. We're gonna stay here and practice all night. All right, you hear that? We're staying all night and practicing. Perfect. Dedication. Dedication, baby. You don't get on the podium by not practicing. Oops. Hey guys, we're back again. So this is our race day, so we're just about to start off, all right? So we're out here today. We got our practices going on. It's pretty good, so I'll give you guys a little track walk. So we have a little jump here. So this our loop is right there. Oh, you guys look right there. So come around here, coming up, eat the doubles, back through. We got a great hobby sponsoring us today. So that's been really good. Um, if you guys can't hear me, you have to let me know in the comments. I'm, a, I'm wearing a mask, so I might guys speak a little bit louder. If I do, just let me know. So we have a tabletop here, so we get to jump this, clear that into a doubles, come through the Z turn, and quick berserk, jump back, and then you're straight away. Pretty good. So we got a pit walk. So we've got some pits. We got Patrick, he's helping with the young guys. There's two cars. We got more people over there. We got Pat. Then we got this guy, Mr. Team Associated. Rocking up, getting his setups all dialed in. We got my pit, as usual. Pretty messy, but chaos. We got my new toolboxes, so there'll be a review going up my channel this week on those, hopefully. I'm gonna tell you guys how I do them, and I'll show you what the inside of this one looks like, and I'll show you what the inside of that looks like, which my part spins. So I'll review my channel, hopefully, hopefully within the next week when this video goes up. So we got Ben with his pit bag and all this stuff. Get that race over here. 17-8, We got Stefan doing last minute helping. We got Ben. We'll oh. follow Ben out here for a little bit, see how he does. Oh, that's a good way to follow Ben. Yeah. He sits like that 98% of the time, so we're okay. It's competition. It's competition, is it? So he's got a 21.9. We'll follow him here. This is two-wheel drive buggy. It's a 5.0 Elite TLR 22. It's an okay two-wheel drive. It handles pretty good. I got Stefan. We got my new body. It still has to get finished. But once it gets all finished, we'll be all set. We gotta cut it out and stuff. And we got Stefan's pit. So that's kind of what we're doing today. And yeah, so I'm just walking kind of stuff on cars. So we're doing pretty good, I say. 19 2. It's uh, hands on, perfect. Yeah, I'll pick you guys up in the pit and probably around after round one. All right, hey guys. So we're picking you up. So we are at lunch right now. So the masks are off. But um, I'm the only one in my pit. So we just finished it off. So uh, four, we'll start with four of our 10 scale buggy. Um, I think I'm sixth place out of six. I'm not doing too good in that one at all. I TQ'd and hold TQ so far for two wheel drive short course track. We finished this up two rounds, that is, and we're gonna do another round here. For stadium track, I am qualified second place. For four wheel short course, I just TQ'd it, so I got second the first round, uh, third the first round, and then I TQ'd the last round. For two wheel drive buggy, I'm mid to back pack. I'm not doing well, it's not handling the way I wanted to. That's some work to do. So this one, okay, so, <clears throat> so, guys, so right now I am going to try to tune up my two dive buggy. My four dive buggy is kind of, if it's in the air, it's iffy. Um, I'll try to do some stuff to it, adjust into it, but I think most of the stuff I have to do to it is outside track day, outside race day stuff. Like, rebuild, I think I'm gonna put a whole new setup on the whole thing, because this setup isn't working that well. But yeah, so we'll see what happens. All right, guys, we got less than 30 seconds. So, quick update, uh, two day buggy. I got it fixed up a lot better. So you're we welcome. Are in the, thank you to this guy right here. <laughs> you're welcome. This guy figured out some stuff that I, I missed. And uh, so we got that fixed up. And now I'm on the BQ. So we'll see what goes up. So I'm hoping to get the bump up spot to Did the you Amy. you the BQ? The BQ. Don't brag about that. It's Why not? I can bring up the BQ. Like this it's guy. <laughs> Ooh, I'm the BQ. That's pretty I'm impressive. Like, well, Considering considering could barely buy the thing at the beginning of the day. Keep Ben Tracing. <laughs> so <laughs> this is this is why Trevor's amazing to pit beside. This is why. We're within we're six feet apart, so we're Gucci that way. We're Gucci that way, guys. But so that's what we're gonna pick up. So racing videos will probably start right after this clip. 
So yeah, so I'll pick you guys up at the end of the day and Patrick, you guys will see the results. I'm not sure I'm gonna edit it yet, so you guys might get races like throughout the whole this is week. Unnecessary information. No one cares. No one cares? Back to the racing details. Back to racing details. No one wants to hear about when you're gonna edit. Just stick to RC. This guy's a subscriber. I'm your, I'm your producer now. <laughs> Smart enough. <laughs> you heard it first. I guess you hired a producer. So this is key, this is safety. Hey Trevor, what's going on video? Crazy times. There's a pandemic. <laughs> what am I to stay home? I need to race too. <laughs> there you go. So we just made sure. Peace safe, right? Yeah. So we just made everything. So we did everything else. So we just went to take pictures and stuff. But um, yeah, so we're gonna get pictures. So yeah, well, you guys will see the results. After two minutes, the top drivers are William Ewerman in first place, followed by Sylvain Debois in second place, followed by Stephen Doucette in third place, followed by Patrick Giona in fourth place, followed by Jonathan Colombo in fifth place.
after four minutes, the top drivers are William Moore in first place, followed by Sylvain Devois in second place, followed by Stephen Doucette in third place, followed by Patrick Giona in fourth place, followed by Jonathan Pelogically in fifth place. Patrick Gionet done. All drivers are finished. 